Alright, Knights of Apollo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the Adventures of Biggest. We're back here in Calradia, and before we jump in, I just wanted to say thank you guys for supporting this playthrough. We are over 30 episodes in, and it still gets like 50k views per episode. That is insane. That is unheard of for a Let's Play on Total War. Like, or Total War. A Let's Play on YouTube. Uh, really, Let's Plays are kind of dead, unless you're like Rad Brad, you know, you're just ginormous. Uh, so thank you guys so much uh, for the support. It means a lot to me, and I'm excited to get this one started. Don't forget to like and subscribe. That helps a ton. I do appreciate it, guys. Let's jump in. All right, so the Kuzates in the Southern Empire are at war with us. We have a rebel uh, situation going on in the other side. Don't really care about the rebels too much because they're not going to expand, but... The Southern Empire needs to be dealt with because they're currently sieging Volstrom, and that is like my most important city. So what I'm going to do is do everything in my power to get there as fast as humanly possible. So we just need to book it. We need to book it. Let's see if we can get there in time. Here we go. Come on, dang it. Because if we don't, we're in big trouble. We're in big time trouble. Uh, and sure enough, the Kuzates are going to siege the city. There's nothing we can do about it. Uh, we're just going to have to circle back and get it. All right, they've begun the siege. I don't know if we're going to get there in time. It's going to be close. Come on. Yes. Yes. All right, break in and help the defenders. Uh, before we do, let's uh, level up some troops. We have no prisoners, so they can't join us. Okay, oh my gosh. We barely got here in time. Let's help Volstrom. All right, let's attack. Okay, here we are, guys. So I forgot to mention this in the intro. Our influence is very low because we've been countering all the opinions of our vassals. So to make a ton of influence quickly in this game is through siege battles and defense because they're going to attack over and over and over and over, and it's going to keep generating more and more influence for us every time we win an engagement. So we just need to keep it up. Um, we got to destroy the two towers. If they just have one ram, no big deal. No big deal at all. So I'm going to put all the extra um, commanders in the infantry so they can help out the infantry. Oh, there we go. Here, we can pick one of you there. There we go. And you can go here. Okay, cool. So, yep. You guys know what to do. We're going to get on the artillery, and then we're going to shoot at the enemy and destroy their siege equipment. Okay, cool. So we're lined up. I'm going to go for this tower over here. So oh, that's going to be short. It's hard to tell with the uh, fire pot ones, but I think I just need to increase the range a little bit, move it a little bit. There we go. This should hit it. Oh, yeah, that's dead on. Boom. Yes. And then we need to quickly turn it and deal with the other tower as soon as we bring this one down. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Mm, beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and turn this over to this side. And we're going to try to guess here. Right there. Awesome. So now um, we could try to get a little bit of the ram. I'm going to lessen it all the way and just shoot the center. Because all they can go by is the center. Yeah, there we go. Like, all they can attack from now is the center, is what I'm trying to say. Come on, load it up. We might be able to get one more hit here. No, that's too bad. All right, so now, guys, here, you know what? I'm going to take one of these pots. We're going to wait for them to get to the gate, and we're just going to throw some rocks at them and just help hold the gate. All right, here we go. They broke down the uh, the gate. Wait, th wait for them to blob up a little bit. All right, I'm going to throw this pot down. Aha! All right, keep on throwing. The splash damage. Oh, we stopped them. Are they running? Okay, perfect. The sooner they run, the better. Because we don't want to kill too many. I know this sounds counterintuitive, but we want as many battles as possible here to get our influence as high as possible. And there we go. See, they haven't left. And as soon as we can, we're going to ambush them. And that's going to force another battle. All right, ambush time. There's only one ram, so we're just going to ride up here and crush them. We could uh, we could try to focus on killing the enemy. There we go. Oh, five damage. I did five damage to the ram. Usually when you run at it and hit it, you uh, you do more damage. I'm just going to run around and kill the archers here. Yeah. Now, I got to be careful because I can't... If I get less than 20%, I'm going to be in trouble because I have to fight. If I don't fight and we auto-resolve, we could lose or we could win and it would end the, the series of battles. 
All right, there we go. We destroyed it. We can retreat. There we go. Yep. Tactical retreat. There we go. Okay, so they're going to attack us here. But before we deal with that, I wanted to look at my holdings here. So my thieves. I only have two. Wait. All right, if we go to parties. Oh, yeah. So I'm going to do unlimited wage and then unlimited wage here. Because I feel like the Azerai might attack us soon because we're busy dealing with the Southern Empire and the Kuzates. So we should always just try to max out our cities in terms of... And we got the money. You know, we're, we're doing okay. So here we go. Another battle. Another opportunity to get some influence. Woo! Look at them all. Look at them all. Look at them all. Fortunately, I kind of missed my opportunity to shoot them. So... All that I can really focus on are the archers, which is fine. I'll just shoot at the archers. Nice. Here comes reinforcement. So this is where I can potentially rack up a lot of kills. So far, I've just been aiming at archers because that's all I can hit. But guys, we're doing really good. We've only lost 10 and they've lost 120. Now remember, we don't want to kill them completely. We want them to break eventually. And the only way to make them break is by quickly inflicting a lot of casualties. All right, here comes another wave of reinforcements. And you can see they just keep getting weaker and weaker. I'm surprised they have not uh, retreated yet. We've killed almost 300 of them. We've only lost 15 men. That is beautiful. There they go. I'm not even here. I'll do one more shot. It's just too fun shooting them. I was going to say, I'm going to stop shooting them so more of them survive, but it's just too much fun. Okay, last shot. Okay, there we go. Whew, and look at all. Oh, and they lost someone on the battlefield. Sucks to suck. Uh, yeah, look at all that influence. Beautiful. All right, that was huge. Um, we could sally out, but there's no need. No need. Let them, let them do it again. Let's gain our influence. Our influence is going up, 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 up. Up and up. Up, 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 up. All right, cool. So we can ambush them again. And that's going to force another fight. So here we go. This time they got a lot of um, siege equipment. But well, that's okay. I'm going to just kill this bannerman real quick. Oh, I missed. Just destroy this. This is The towers are the easiest to destroy. For some reason, the enemy only defends the ram. I mean, it kind of makes sense. I guess the ram is the most important piece. <laughs> Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Got to be careful there. Cannot die. Cannot go below 20. Come on, get the ram, guys. Get the ram. Come on, get it, guys. Get it. You almost got it. There we go. Got the bannerman. Almost got it, guys. Don't surrender. Don't or don't retreat. Come on. Almost. Almost. There we go. Retreat. Retreat. Yep. Woo. Sometimes those rams are tough to get. All right, cool. So uh, let's attack. Okay, so same thing, guys. Um, I'm going to... Here, let's move this. I like the ballista. Ooh, that's a fire ballista too. So we'll change it out with this and then put this here. I'm just going to get up here, shoot at the enemy. It's going to be super easy, guys. It's going to be like a no-brainer. So I think, honestly, at this point, I might just tell my men to sally out and finish this. I mean... Oh, they do have some reinforcement. Hold on. Let's not get too crazy. We've just been up here shooting them. They are getting obliterated. Um, they don't really have a chance here. And we're starting to see all their low quality troops arrive. All right, there they go. They're running again. This time we need to kill as many as possible. Because we're going to sally out and finish this once and for all. And get a ton of renown. Just a ton of renown. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to make this here everyone, everyone charge. Let's not finish this, guys. Or let's well let's finish it, but let's not end the battle just quite yet. All right, so they're pretty much all gone. We killed 158. We lost 28, and that's huge. Now we should be able to sally out, and once we do this, we should get a ton of renown and, or influence. Right, influence is key. All right, cool. So let's sally out Woo! we it's still it's still kind of crazy close but i say we do it let's let's sally out and finish this once and for all all right cool so at this stage of the battle they really shouldn't have anything too scary so we're gonna have our infantry and shield wall these guys in loose formation standard formations guys standard formation we'll get the uh horse archers like dragoons boom 
I like I like that deployment. It's nice. So I assume, oh, they have 365 uh, infantry and 157 archers. So they have, oh, hello. Okay. Cavalry after me! Get some backup here. I can't die because this battle is going to be close. Get him, horsemen. Cavalry! Follow me! All right. Let's see. Are they going to move forward? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to set up the infantry here. The archers here. Nice. First blood. Let's go. Second blood. Oh, they finally got a kill. You know what? Here, let's get our infantry into line and just throw them in the mix of this so they can help out with this enemy cav. The archers are here now. Nice. This seems to be going pretty well. Archers move forward. Very nice. Actually, let's get the archers right here, right? And then we're gonna have the infantry up here. Oh, I want them to form a shield wall. Woo, careful. Horse archers, go ahead and advance. Oh, archers, where are you going? You're going the wrong way. Archers, I wanted you over here. I must have misclicked. Here, Cav, go down here. Come on, guys, we're getting chewed up here by their archers. Screw it, I'm charging my Cav into their archers just to buy some time. Okay. Okay, I have fall back. My infantry is looking the wrong way. Infantry set up here. I don't want to fight yet. I want the archers to do their thing. Horse archers set up in the tree line. There we go. There we go. Nice. Very nice. Oh, we are melting them. Cav, charge. Infantry go into line. Horse archers charge. Nice job, guys. Finish the stupid empire. There we go. Nice. We lost 76 there. Not bad. I guess it could have been better. It could have been better. All right, everyone charge. Finish this. They've got reinforcements. Hold on. Reform. 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 Do not, do not charge their infantry. Hang it, guys. Their archers. Get up here. Infantry here. Let's not be careless. We still have 149 troops. And we almost lost 100 men. 100. Come on, fire, guys. Troops! Soldiers! Why did you charge in, horse archers? I have you on advance. Idiots. Well, I guess it doesn't matter if I go down now. Battle's over. All right, everyone charge. I think they're breaking now. There we go. We lost 102. Dang. Wanted to do a little cleaner than that, but that's okay. Kind of messed up with my formation. Look at that influence. Well done. And that's how you do it, folks. That's how you do it. We gained a ton of influence. We gained a ton of prisoners. We defended Volstrom. Guys, I can't ask, I can't ask for a better start to this episode. All right, cool. So we're going to return to Volstrom. And first off, we're going to execute. We don't have a lot of prisoners here. We should have a lot more. So I'm hoping that my vassals will put their prisoners in my dungeon. I have a feeling they're not. Yeah, this is what you get. All right, cool. So we executed all of them. Very fun. And now we're going to go to the tavern. We'll get some cav. And then we're going to ransom all the extra prisoners. All right, cool. Ransom the extra prisoners. I don't think we can trade here, can we? Oh, they've got 81,000. So we can trade a little bit there. Free up some space. Make a little cash. I see this new armor here. It actually looks... It's not as good leg armor, but it's overall better. There we go. So some better armor nice we'll make positive money there though that's expensive armor all right cool so we got some new armor now it's time for us to take back who, who's in f folk so we're gonna take that back um actually we're gonna wait here for some time oh the valandians have declared war on us okay um interesting that might be a problem because they they kind of have some territory okay i don't know they'll either show up or they won't you know that's sometimes people look you know people declare war and they don't do anything all right so let's check the the dungeon i'm curious to see if they dropped off any of the lords no they did not i'm gonna keep waiting here a little bit we're just gonna wait here for some time and see if they drop off any more lords uh we're gonna have to up our cohesion and do we have any i kind of want to let yeah i might let some of these guys go so they can rebuild that's gonna be like all a lot of my influence all right, come on. Put the enemy lords in my dungeon, please. Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna sit here and wait for them to do that. All right, so let's go take back our other city. 
we got to hustle over this way. And we're going to recruit along the way. Just stop at these villages and recruit. All right, cool. So we recruited. We're, we've got our army up to 600. Not even going to be a big deal. There's only 126 defenders here. So we're going to easily take back this city. Easily. All right, excellent. So uh, we've built the siege equipment. We're just going to send in the troops. And we're going to get some more renown for this. Some influence, 23. Not bad. Um, we've got some militia troops, which we'll just drop off inside the city. We'll take the prisoners. Bada bing, bada boom. But while we're here, let's go ahead and manage the town. Make sure they're happy. Festival and games. And then uh, we're going to have to give up this city, unfortunately, to some idiot that are, you know, they're probably going to run it to the ground. I don't have enough influence to say no. And that's the problem. That's why I need to gain more influence. That is the biggest issue here. Um, let's go ahead and make some money while we're here. And then uh, let's go to the keep and manage garrison and drop off any militia we have. Okay, I think we dropped off. It's 52 militia. That's pretty good. Um, so we'll leave them in there. We'll uh, we'll sit here for a couple turns and go to the dungeon. Just see if there's any lords in here. Oh, we got ourselves a lord. I'm taking him. Oh, see, this is why you got to check, guys. This is why you got to check. Why you got to check. All right, cool. So we took care of them. And I think we have peace right now. Or in, in, not peace, but we have calm. Uh, and the question is, do we go for this rebel city? I have a feeling that while we're away, they're going to attack again. Mm, I guess in the meantime, let's let's just kind of recruit and see what happens. We're kind of we kind of have to wait and see what the enemy does here, which really sucks. We're not at that point where we can really set the, the initiative, you know, and, and do what we want. We just have to uh, wait for them to make a move. There it is. There's the move. Okay. All right. So we can give away this city again. I'll just give it to this guy. Don't mess it up, bro. Don't let them rebel or you're going to lose your head. All right, cool. So let's see who's sieging this city over here. All right. Um, they've got 409. Um, that's a really crappy army. So we don't, we don't have to sneak in for this one. Honestly, we'll just let them attack. We got time. We have time. All right. You know what? Screw it. I'm going in. <laughs> I'm not going to wait for them to attack. I'm, I'm just going to... Or not? Come on, go. Yes, assault the camp. Yeah, this is... I'll fight this one. I feel like I need to fight him because I feel like I get more influence that way. So we'll see. All right, cool. So we got a bridge battle here. Interesting. Uh, let's just go ahead and assign all these lords to whatever. And then I'm just going to start the battle and see where the enemy position is. And it's good to it's good to fight every battle. I know I auto-resolve just for convenience sake. Here, let's just take um, my cav and my horse archers to follow me. We're just going to see what, what we got, what we're working with here. Now, I assume they're not going to... Are they... Oh, they're running across. Look at my army, dude. Oh, okay. You guys chill here. Chill here for now. Where are they going? I don't know. All right, this is... Let's just start moving the troops, getting them in position. This is what I'm going to do. I, I kind of like this combo we did last time where we had the infantry angled one position. Let's take the infantry here. I'll, I'll put them in shield wall once they get closer. And then the archers, which I can go ahead and put into uh, loose formation. I'm going to get them kind of off angle to where the infantry is. There we go. What are you guys doing? Don't be crazy. Let's take our... Uh, horse archers and go ahead and, and mobilize them and i'm gonna take my calf tell them to follow me and we're gonna go after their horses over here we're gonna get behind them with our calf too ah come on calf so slow i'm almost dead this sucks Okay, awesome. So the infantry is getting into position. I'm going to go ahead and tell them to go into shield wall. Tell the horse archers to charge. Get my cav over here. All right, there we go. Shots have been fired. And they're just sitting there. Beautiful. We are melting them. We've lost one soldier so far. Let's keep it up. All right, there goes the horse archers. You know what, horse archers? Let's line up here and fire at them. Get behind them. There you go. All right, still only lost one troop. Cav move forward they don't know what to do it looks like they're charging so i'm gonna get my guys into line all right they stopped charging i'm gonna get them back into shield wall oh wait no all right now they're charging dang it they're juking me out dang it i'm gonna go ahead and tell them to charge tell my cab to charge all right we're definitely gonna lose more hopefully we 
less than 30. That would be great. There we go. We're hitting them from two sides. All right, we lost eight so far. Come on, guys. 19. Clean them up. Oh, they got reinforcements. Not much, though. Just a bunch of peasants. All right, everyone charge now. 24. Nice. Less than 30. It's not over, though. I'm not going to die to a peasant, all right? There we go. They're running. All right, that's how you do it, folks. We need to win these battles like this with as little casualties as possible because we're going to get a lot of renown for it and we're also going to be able to level up our troops to a high like level. All right, cool. So we'll end it here. We lost 25. We killed 213. Let's go. All right, and we got some prisoners. Yay. Oh, three? Make it four. Aw, oh, just three. All right, so you know what we're going to do next execute the prisoners all right so that was huge i feel like we're pushing the southern empire to peace every single victory we earn they get weaker and weaker i mean look at the casualties in fact inflicted difference i mean we've inflicted uh 4, casualties they've inflicted 1700 so yeah I, uh, things are looking pretty good kuzates not so much um they're still pretty powerful, so we gotta watch out for them. I really wanna take this rebel city. It's just so far away, and you know they're gonna attack Volstrom soon. I just feel it. I just feel it. Uh, so I guess in the meantime, we're just gonna recruit and once again, wait for the enemy to make a move. Well, dang, guys, it has been fairly peaceful. Um, I kind of wish we did make a move for the rebel city way in the south. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go for it. Well, thank goodness I'm over here. Oh my gosh, dude. All right, we can take this out really fast. Good timing, honestly. See, this is why I need to control the cities, but I just don't have enough influence to force that vote. So let's go destroy them. Oh, and then the Azurites declare war on us. Okay, that's nice. All right, I'm just gonna send the troops in. This should be very easy. Ah, losing 71 hurts, but it's okay. And then we've got uh, some prisoners, which... Oh, and then we freed up some people. Oh, and we unlocked some troops as well. Sweet! Okay, that helps a lot, unlocking those troops. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right, we're going to show mercy, and then we're going to uh, chop off the heads of those rebels. I mean, definitely we're going to kill the rebels. Okay, now uh, we got to deal with the Azurai, because you know they're going to siege us. The Azurai is going to have a pretty strong army, because they've been doing nothing. But whenever that happens, you know, they, they usually have high-quality, big armies. Uh... I would love to keep this city for myself. It's just not going to happen. So I guess we just, here we go. New owner. Can it be me? All right, well, let's give it to a new guy. Uh, we'll give it to you. How about that? Don't, don't let rebels take over now, please. All right, my child is getting older. I don't really care. It's a crack shot. Sure. Sure, whatever. It doesn't matter. They're just future generals that I'm going to muster. Oh, easy battle. All right, let's do it again, guys. Another easy battle against the Southern Empire. When will they learn? All right, I'm just going to go in when it's sunny. Assault the siege camp. We could auto-resolve, but uh, should we auto-resolve? I feel like it. Yeah, we'll just send in the troops. 38. Ugh, maybe we should have fought it. All right. Well, next time we won't do that. It's way faster, though. That's for sure. We got some prisoners. Sweet. More lords to kill. All right. I think think the southern empire is gonna be at its end here because they are running out of so many lords and they keep trying to attack me with no success so i think eventually they're gonna quit i hope well they're still demanding 5,000 gold for tribute even though we're absolutely annihilating them and my Whatever the vassals want, they're going to get. That is for sure. All right, let's... um. Oh, see, look who joined them. The rebels joined them. Okay, we got to get down there. Let's just hope that they don't attack anything else. Well, let's just hope for the best. And I think I'm going to swap out a lord here. Um, Someone who's, who's the lowest lord. 22. I think 22 is the lowest number. And then I'm going to swap them with um, you because you're free influence. And yeah, we'll go from there. Kind of strengthen our numbers without losing influence. Yeah, sure enough, they're attacking the castle, guys. I don't think we're going to get there in time. They're probably going to take it. We're going to try, though. Well, dang it. I'm not going to lose this city. Someone's sieging this city. There's only 26 defenders. We got to try to get over there. I would rather lose a castle than a city. If we can, if we could just chip away, if we can get peace with the Southern Empire, I'd be happy. Oh, it was the Kuzates. 
No shocker there. They probably took it with one guy, too. We're gonna... Oh, no, they have an army of 400. Um, yeah, we'll just... We'll just surround them in there. Besiege. And then we'll kill them all. This one, we're gonna have to, unfortunately, probably fight. Now they're sieging this city over here. <laughs> it just doesn't end, does it? <laughs> gonna attack from all kinds of different people. Isn't it fun? And now our castle's under siege. Wow. So we gotta, we gotta take this out quick. Oh, they took it, dude. They're coming over to fight us? They don't have the strength to fight us. God, I hate them. They come after me when I'm busy doing other things. All right, we destroyed the walls. All right, I'm going in. I am going in. Let's see if we can get any more prisoners. Yeah, we can get one more. Let's level up the boys before they're ready to fight. Here we go. Uh, let's attack. You know, honestly... I think if we can get, if we can get uh, the Southern Empire and the Kuzates to negotiate peace, we could easily attack uh, the Azerai by myself. Uh, as long as we can, you know, find their armies when they're, you know, like the way we beat them is when they siege us and we sneak into the cities and we defeat them that way. Uh, that is the best way to beat them. So I, I definitely think if we can just push the Kuzates in the Southern Empire to peace, we might have a chance. We just might have a chance. All right, here we go. Charge! Charge, men! Take these walls! There we go. I'm gonna bring down these defenses. So we can get around them. Nice. Get the heck out of here. Oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> Yeah, keep pushing. Ow. Oh, help. Dang it. <laughs> All right, that's fine. We're making good progress on that side. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take it. And the good news is like the enemy should most likely siege us after this. There we go. Nice guys, keep it up. We've lost 135 men. It, it's it's a bloody battle, but it's how it's gotta be against these damn Kuzates. There we go. Defeated them. So again, I expect the uh, Kuzates to siege us. It sucks. It kind of keeps us locked in while we're getting sieged elsewhere. But hopefully we can defeat these Kuzates quick. So yeah, we're just going to wait inside and see what the enemy does here. Yeah, and sure enough, they're going to attack. This is going to be tough because honestly, I feel like we should sally out. I feel like we should sally out bring the fight to them i might just do it i don't know i don't know i kind of need i need i kind of need more health let's just wait get a little bit healthier yeah you know what i'm gonna sally out i'm gonna sally out and fight them it's gonna be a close battle but i'm not gonna sit here and wait for them to make a move we also have to defend this castle and then we got to deal with the azurai so let's do it Ooh, a little river crossing battle interesting interesting all right let's just let's just hold where we are and see what the enemy is. Now being, oh yeah, being the Azurai, they are gonna send forward their horse archers. Wow, look at this battlefield. This is a weird battlefield, awkward. But we're just gonna hold our position here and let the archers do all the work. Looks like they're coming for us. This is good. All right, here comes the horse archers. We got this lone guy over here. I'm gonna try to kill him. What is he doing? You and me, battle to the end. What are you doing? You, are you a vassal? The shield can't hold my hits forever. This guy, dude. All right, here comes the horse archers. Come on, archers. I'm gonna charge them with my calf. I'm gonna move the archers to face them. If we can take care of the horse archers. It's over. There we go. Nice. Kill the horse archers. Move up, archers. Keep chasing them. Yep, keep chasing them. I'm going to go ahead and move up my horse archers as well. Uh, let's keep moving up the archers. Really? You block that? <clears throat> Come on. All right. Well, this is really annoying. The horse archers are annoying and they're just going to be running back and forth. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to move my entire army. Follow me. Follow me. And we're going to go up to this ledge because eventually we got to engage the Kuzates who are just like just 
complete cowards. Look at them. So we're going to set up at this tree line. Um, infantry, we'll go ahead and put you into line so you run a little bit faster. And yeah, we're going to set up the archers here. Actually, we'll set them up here. Infantry here. Come on. Oh my god, this map is a headache. Wish I could have my RTS camera. All right, here comes their horse archers again. Still trying to get my army into position. So I'm just going to I'm just going to scare them off with my cav. Just to make sure they don't charge my my archers, which it looks like they're making a move for. Make sure they don't hit the archers, guys. There you go. Downhill, like epic Lord of the Rings style. Nice. Got a kill. All right, I'll retreat my cav and continue to wait for my stupid army to get in position. All right, here they come again. The horse archers. Going to go ahead and charge them. See if we can get them by surprise here. Kill a couple of them. And there they go. They're running off. Nice. I'll retreat the cav. Archers are finally getting into position. I'm going to be able to fire. You know what? Honestly, I should go up on this big hill and look down at their army. Yeah, right here. Set up the archers. Put the infantry here. Here comes their horse archers again. Yay! We're going to go run them off. They're starting to run out of horse archers, so... Sort of. Had enough of you, horse archers. Had enough. All right, excellent. Archers are getting into position. Make sure their cav isn't charging me. Beautiful. Perfect spot. There you go, archers. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep up that rate of fire. Here comes the rest of my infantry. They can go into shield wall soon. Go ahead and move them down a little bit. I'll move the archers up a little bit so more of them can fire. There we go. This is going to be a bit of a shootout. Infantry, it's going to get you into shield wall. Block those arrows. Soldiers! Push up my cab. Go after the horse archers. Bloody battle, guys, but we will win this one. Horse archers, let's get you on the flank over here. Soldiers! Fire. Charge my cav so they can engage enemy cav. Here comes their infantry. Horse archers, I'll go ahead and tell you to charge. My infantry go into shield uh, line. Go ahead and charge. Get the hell out of here. Use a trash. There we go. Come on, infantry. It's a bloody battle. But I think we're going to win it. Man, dude. My infantry just can never win. I need like god tier infantry. Why is there falling horses? Why is there horses just falling through the sky? Okay, there we go. Now we can fast forward. Yay. All right. We're waiting for our reinforcements, I suppose. Oh yeah, we had reinforcements spawn. Yeah, we outnumber them two to one now. What are we doing here, guys? We're just letting them kill us? That's nice. Nice, I'm really glad we're doing this. There we go, get them archers. Oof. Nasty Kuzade army, but it's a dead one. We lost many good men in this battle. It was not a fun battle, but it was a necessary battle. And we continue to fight on for the sovereignty of our empire. And we've got some prisoners. We, we get to lob off their heads. Okay, so we've defended the city. Uh, we're getting attacked on multiple fronts. 
We're gonna go defend this castle. Um, we need to chop off the heads of our prisoners, which we have three of them. All right, cool. So let's try to get to this castle over here in time. All right, we're losing lords here. Here we go. Hurry. They're taking some castles. As long as they don't take this city, I'm okay. God, it's like the Azurais are, Azurai are right back in it. They're right back in it. Okay, and then here's another army of 600. Yay! All right, um, can we have peace with anyone? 50% with the Southern Empire, the Kuzates. Why do we still have to pay them so much money? Tell me why. They would agree to peace with the Kuzates. That would help. Um, let's try to take this city back really quick. Oh, they're going to siege, aren't they? Gosh. All right, how many defenders do we have in here? 86. All right, we can quickly take this, right? We're gonna quickly take this and then go back and defend the castle, hopefully. All right, just send in the troops. We lost one person. That's pretty sweet. Oh, we unlocked 29 troops. I would gladly take them. We're gonna show mercy, and we just gotta book it. We gotta, we, it sucks, but we got to. We gotta go defend this castle. Run, run. Now nah, they're gonna take it. Go, 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 go. Yes, help the defenders. Oh, all right, all right. Uh, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure we can auto resolve this. All right, here we go. Let's just auto resolve this because we don't have the time. There we go. Pretty swell. Pretty swell. That saves a lot of time. I'm a prisoner now. Oh my gosh. You guys are all screwed. Screwed, I tell you. All right. And then let's take the prisoners and chop their heads off. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. Okay, cool. So we defended our territory, guys. Now here's the thing. I don't... I, I'm so ready to kill the Azurai. Like, I'm so ready to destroy them. We've held, we've held on to pretty much everything over here. Um, I really just want to focus on the Azurai, but we can't until we have peace. Now, if we look at our diplomacy, most everybody wants peace with the Southern Empire and the Kuzates. I don't want to initiate it, though. Because I don't want to lose that influence. Because I'm going to save all my influence on killing killing the Azurai. That is what I want to do. So in the meantime, I'm going to recruit in hope that somebody casts a vote for peace. No. All right. We got to deal with the Azurai. We have to. We can't. It's, it's a risk. Ugh. All right. How about this? How about this? I will negotiate peace. I'll do one faction. I'll make it the Kuzates. I'll propose. It's going to cost 50 influence. It's not too bad. 50 influence is not too bad. So we have peace with the Kuzates. We can also, you know what? I might just spend the influence just to secure our borders. We're going to go negative too with money, you know, um, because it just costs so much for this piece. But now we can focus everything on the Azurai. Let's see how defend it. Oh, if we have 571 defenders in there. No way they're taking that city. No way they're going to take it. But now that we have peace, we can let this area of our empire heal and, and they can get more troops in their garrison. Oh, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Are you kidding me? You're joking, right? Wow, he killed 33 of our men. No, oh, it's probably mostly the villagers. He just rolls up and attacks our village? Yeah, I don't I don't think so. All right, let's get to the city. Quick, guys, quick. What? Who's sieging us here? Who? No! Damn it! All right, we got to go here and defend it because there's only 28 defenders. I have a feeling they're going to hold here. 571 defenders? That's not an easy task. Oh, you're so dead, dude. Ah! That's so annoying. All right, let's take care of this guy. These are the rebels, by the way. They absolutely deserve death. Oh, 37 troops. Thank you very much. Well, we didn't capture them, but that's okay. All right, you know what? I'm going to drop off some troops in this city so it's not so easy to take. There's literally no, no troops in here. I'm just going to take all the crap troops, the militia, just to get them like at least <clears throat> 50. There, 51 troops, just to help a little bit there. All right, let's go defend our very important city. Come on, guys, go. Now or never. They've yet to begun the attack. They know it's too dangerous. And I'm in dire need of troops. I'm gonna have to summon some troops here. Um, these guys are kind of expensive to summon. Uh, let's see. Let's let go of you. 
and summon you. Okay, let's go kill this person real quick. Send in the troops. All right. Killed more of them. God, you would think auto resolve would kind of help us out here a little bit, but apparently not. This is what we're going to do. We're going to just wait here because they just don't have it in them. Unless they starve them out, which is a possibility. Okay, this is... Let's... Peerage. Influence costs a ruler. No. So they're going to make it so over... No. No, I'm not doing that. I, that's worth 150 influence. All right, this is what we're going to do. We're going to sneak inside the city and um, force them to attack. We're going to ambush them. Ambush, ambush, ambush. The Northern Empire declares war on me. All right, all right. We can ambush them. Nice. All right. So this is going to force them to siege us. And when they do siege us, we are going to sally out after they fail and destroy their army. And I, I just can't imagine the Azerai uh, having another army. You know what I mean? They're so weak. They shouldn't... Oh, ow. Alright, we destroyed it. I'm just gonna ride around and kill these guys. Or at least try to kill them. Leave my city alone. Go home while you still have one. Alright, let's retreat. Alright, um, we should be able to just send troops, so let's do that. Alright, send the troops. Easy victory. Oh yeah, that was huge. And we're gonna get a bunch of prisoners, which uh, I will gladly execute. It never gets old. You know, every, oh, that we've got so many too. Oh, this is nice. Ah, this is gonna be fun. Just think, every every Lord I kill, that's one less I have to deal with against the Azurai. And now is when the, now's the time when we turn on the, uh, the propane. It's time to burn some places down no we're gonna we're gonna go conquer it's gonna be awesome so let's go take a city uh we're about having peace no no they want peace now decline i don't want peace with you are you kidding me peace you shall have none no peace for the wicked and all these castles should yeah they're lightly defended that's why they're desperate for peace because we just destroyed their best army okay and we can just send in the troops easy peasy lemon squeezy there goes another castle under our control i'll take all the militia and then just put them in the castle to help defend it make it a little bit more difficult to take you know i'm just gonna go through here and just drop off all of the militia all right cool so that's 26 defenders right there that's all i can spare let's take back our city that we lost i'm gonna go ahead and release uh two of my companions here and summon a new companion um just because we need more troops yeah so i'm just letting go of the companions that have low you know low amount of troops and uh or, or vassals who do we give this to i guess we'll give it to this person because they have two people voting for him whatever don't care just make sure you don't lose it that's all i ask all right now we need to blitzkrieg and i'm talking blitzkrieg now this is going to be probably the most difficult city to take but the good news is that they only have enough food for three days and this army here is desperately trying to fight me but it ain't gonna happen ah they're sieging us okay i'm not gonna lose any ground here so i'm gonna go back and defend it we could at the very least try to get this guy to join us let's see if he does it uh oh you're the sultan Never mind. You die. You die. Oh, is this? Oh, we just got the whole army. Nice. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, please tell me. Please tell me we got the sultan. Ah, we didn't get the sultan. Uh, I guess he lives another day. I don't really care. All right. Let's go ahead and kill these two lords we got here. Sweet. All right. And then we're going to go back and do what we were doing, which is sieging. I'm going to go ahead and summon this person here. It's going to cost a little bit of influence. I got to be careful with my influence because I need to delay peace as long as possible with the Azurai. We must delay peace. There's another army forming over here. Embarrassing. Go ahead and besiege. And look at they're already one day down with food. So if they... uh. 
I, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna starve him out. Just starve him out. No need, no need to fight him. Well, actually, I might, I might fight him just to get some influence. They want peace with the Azurai. We'll receive two thousand gold. No, no, we're not doing this again, guys. We're not doing this again. All right, they have, they no longer have any food, so they should start uh, starving here. Yep, there they go. They're starting to bleed troops. All right, so we've destroyed most of their i don't want to destroy their walls so i'm going to retire the artillery just for now because we're remember we're just starving them starving them out no rush all right let's go ahead uh well next morning we're going to uh destroy them okay this is good enough we're gonna go in actually yeah yeah let's go in let's go in and send oh no 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 not i didn't mean to send the troops i meant to actually attack but that's okay we still won Oh, and we got 18 troops here. Nice. Nice. They are so desperate for peace. It's nice to have this city back. It really is. So let's trade. We got a bunch of loot we need to get rid of. All right, cool. So that's another 100K. And we're now at a million gold. So uh, now my goal here is... Oh, they're sieging our castle? I don't think so. Our goal here is to... Um, before we have peace, I want this castle and I want these two cities here. And then I will be happy. So let's go defend our castle. We might want to go to the keep and put some troops in the garrison. So if we have any cheap troops, which we do. All right, cool. So we put 22 troops in there. It's not a lot, but it's better than nothing. I most likely will not get to keep this city. Uh, they will vote against me. And I'm not wasting my influence to try to save it because I don't want them to vote for peace if they vote for peace i have to counter it let's see all right who who's the best like who can um i guess i'll give it to you don't lose it all right this is an important city don't lose it the rebellion all right here they are sieging again an army of 248 oh tragic they're dead now they're dead isn't that just tragic I know you're out. Yes. Oh, 17 troops. Thank you very much. And we'll go ahead and kill that dumb bimbo. You're dead. All right, that's another lord gone. They just never learn. They just never learn. So now we got to go and defend our city. I don't want peace with these a-holes because they're just going to attack us later with our guard down and gobble up a bunch of territory. It ain't going to happen. Now, I'll try to go to this guy and ask him if he wants to join us, but it's most likely he won't. All right, you're dead. Send in the troops. And I know this is tedious to do all the auto-resolving and stuff. Oh, good. You're dead. Nice. I get to kill her. All right. So we executed her. Now let's go take our castle back, which they took from us. And uh, take so much more. Let's look at their strength after all this fighting. Oh, they're still stronger than us. Amazing. Just amazing. Isn't that just amazing? All right. I just want three more cities. I just want three more cities. That's all I'm asking for. All right. This castle should be easy to take. Now they're going to go siege my... Uh, my city over there, aren't they? Yes, they are. The Kuzates have declared war on us. All right. Dang it, dude. Why? Why? All right. Just send in the troops. We took it. Dang it, dude. I, I just can't right now. I just can't with the Kuzates. All right. We're going to show mercy. We'll wait here for some time. Just a little bit. So we got to go defend our city. So we've taken back what we originally had against the Azurai. The damn Kuzates, they're going to easily take our loot. Or, or not our loot, our cities while we're busy. Oh, that's so annoying. I, I just, I, if I could just have one faction declare war against me at a time, this would be a cakewalk. Get these jerks out of here. How do they still have these troops? Send in the troops. There we go. Yeah, we're utterly crushing them now. Oh, that sucks. You're gonna die. All right, let's go ahead and kill her. She shouldn't have been sieging my, my city. You could have avoided this. You could have avoided this. All right, and let's go take this city. At the very least, let's just try to take two more cities from them. And we'll give this away to... Oh, we'll give it to you because you're... He looks like an Azurai. I think he's, a... I think he's of Azurai descent. So maybe he'll do a good job, you know, leading. And now the Southern Empire has declared war on us. And so everything repeats. Well, I'm going to sacrifice this that city for this one. Ugh, God, they have 700 defenders. I don't care. They can take it if they want. I'm taking the Azurai out. Decline. They can they can take that city. Again, I don't care. I'm taking the Azurai out. That is the goal. That is the plan. One less faction, the better. Even if we lose territory on the other side, so be it. Yeah, come on. Attack me. I won't do it. All right, guys. I think it's now is the time. Now or never. 
We don't have time. We got to go in. I'm going to bolster up my army as much as I can because everything's under siege. Everything's going to hell. And I think it would be wise of us to negotiate peace with the Azurai after we take this city. So let's fight. All right, here we go. So we've destroyed all the walls, I'm pretty sure, right? Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't destroy the walls. Okay, that's fine. We just got to wait for... I thought we did. We got to just wait for the siege equipment to get into position. And uh, this is going to be a tough battle. Uh, wow, why did they give them so many troops? They gave them three, 730. We have 250, but... The, okay, whatever. Whatever. All right, the siege equipment has gotten into place. This is the uh, moment of truth. We've got them down to 669. So they are getting low. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Getting good hits with the artillery. We're gonna help out this siege equipment. Make it a little bit faster. Not really, but it adds up. And we gotta look out for the murder holes here. Just gonna wait. Charge. Oh, nobody's at the gate? Wow. All right, this is gonna be easier than I thought. Easier than I thought. Storm, guys, storm. Oh, we got some archers here. There we go, guys. Clean them up. Take this damn city from them. Teach them a lesson to attack us with our guard down. You trash. Oh, jeez. This is kind of epic, this fight in the street. Yeah. Keep pushing. Oh, jeez. All right, fall back. <laughs> All right, they're at 300. We're at 137, but we have reinforcements. This is looking pretty good. There we go. Push. Nice. Pretty soon we'll have reinforcements here. Maybe we won't need them. Push them. Clear out the archers. Nice. Our reinforcements have shown up. They're down to 80 troops. This battle is over. Oh, sorry. I killed them too. I straight up killed them. Oh, my bad. We only lost 60 men. Would have been 59 if it wasn't for my stupidity. What are you doing? Nothing. Clean it out, men. Clean it out. All right, guys, we won the day. They retreated to the keep. The city will be ours in one more auto resolve. And then we can negotiate peace with the Azurai. And I'm pretty happy about it. I would have liked one more city, but I just don't think we have the chance to do it because we're under attack by the whole world. All right, cool. We lost one person there. Take the prisoners, take the loot. Um, let's show mercy. And then we're gonna negotiate peace. Peace, baby. Peace. We'll receive 2,000 gold, which is kind of bullcrap. We should receive more. Peace with the Azurai.
That's one less enemy we have to worry about. Okay. So, guys, we are out of, we're out of time. We are out of time. But we gained back pretty much all that we lost from the Azurai. Um, over here, uh, Volstrom is under attack. They haven't begun the siege. And then over here, I don't really see the city standing. It's like the Southern Empire and the Kuzates are just buddy-buddy, you know? But we push the Azurai to the point where they have three more cities and two castles. So I don't think they're going to be attacking us anytime soon. Guys, we are out of time. Thank you so much for joining us on this fun adventure. Next episode, we got we, once again, we got to fight the Southern Empire and the Kuzates and try to defend our Northern Territory. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And oh my gosh, it's been playing. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's all right. Uh, thanks, for, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time in Calradia.